This is the energy vibration reading for the Scorpion, which is Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like, shares, and support from you, Scorpion. So, um, let's go in and see what is happening. This week is a water week, so it's a positive week for you guys. Um, the zodiac energy is Earth from Monday until Saturday. On Sunday, the energy changed to um, the zodiac energy of the hair. Now, in this week, what do we have to contend with? Week begins from the 17th until the 23rd. So let's see what's happening for you, Scorpions. Monday is not a good day for you, Scorpions. Whatever is happening, it's not a good day. Tuesday, your um, intuition is, is um, whatever you're receiving about the... the um, a young lady that is Centaurus Virgo or a Capricorn and a man that is the Knight of Wands okay alrighty so what is happening and what is transpiring is that whatever is happening Monday you're not going to feel good because it's as if your intuition is guiding you about something about um, someone who is between the ages of 25 and 40 and a situation with either is it our father or someone that it is, is something is off something is off yeah an ain't count an ain't come that um if some of you are sick if some of you are sick be careful help come help come help come for you help come now alrighty okay the week has to do with um, success success come for you guys the week have to do with success some success is going to be coming out but there's just some sad things that is going on with you scorpions um, um you know um Hmm. Call upon the universal angels and guides for divine protection. Call upon Archangel Michael, supervisor of Thorn Element Master, Fire, Fire Salamander, and Fire Dragons, to flow through you and surround you on Monday. Whatever is happening, you're not feeling well on Monday. There is just some negative energies. There's some there is a man that is an Aries, an old man. An old man and this young woman that is a a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this 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 woman and this man has gotten connected and uh, someone is watching this lady though this 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 lady whoever this this Capricorn person is she got so connected with this man however it is she got so connected with this man and um, be careful of these these people okay and because your reading is like this um some help is going to be coming out with an organization or from an organization some help is going to be coming out okay i need to see everything of all your energies because an end to a negative situation some luck is going to be coming from you from a friend um this man is a, a black man there was some theft your energy has been taken away the theft is over you're going to make a, a new start so I am um, be careful you scorpions out there um this is what I'm receiving okay and for some reason I did this and um, 
the moon comes up with some happiness that is going to be coming in it's so as your spirit guides and your guiding angels are going to be divinely intervening in whatever the situation for you some of you scorpion is as if someone wants to kill you but they can't do it hell no they didn't give you life they can't take your life because that is what the eight of swords with a coffin is saying is that someone wants to kill you but it's not happening it can't happen okay it's not gonna happen not gonna happen your spirit guides are going to be helping you and you better say thank you to them okay whoever you are you better say thank you for, to them now some of you have um, a relationship with someone who is um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn I think this is the only honest person that you're dealing with this is the only honest person that you're dealing with this Capricorn person is uh, or it's not really a Capricorn it is a um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn it doesn't I'm getting Capricorn for some people you could be working with this person but um, there's some spying there is some spying and uh, someone who is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra is spying on this situation and she's gonna decide to make a move she's gonna because this is going to happen in the weekend on Sunday whoever this person is it could be at your work you're working with someone and and this person is spying on both of you now whoever this person is you're, you have been in a relationship with her and she's going to decide to make a move and the person who is going to decide to help her so call upon the angels and guides because I'm getting this nasty smell of lower energies and all, all you have to do is to, um, call upon mighty powerful angels to remove um, whatever this energy is so there is someone there is someone you have gotten yourself involved with an Aries man an Aries man okay it could be an Aries Libra or a Sagittarius whoever these people are it's as if they're trying to have you under control and whatever they are trying to do is very bad and it's very sad and they're going to have a bitter ending okay um, and this is it you people work and pay other people to do other people things and this is the same shit that is coming back at you okay because you people need to understand that um, whatever you give out and whoever you pay to hurt someone else this is exactly what is happening to you and be careful because there is the energy of debt because <sighs> people are trying um, you pay to take someone life and someone is paying to take your life whatever is happening this is sick this is a really really sick people and it's about time that you people wake up and realize that no one has the power to take another life because here you're not feeling good on on Monday it's because of something that you have done you have done something and you know what you have done you have uh, you know and you have done something okay you try um, but the end of this whoever is trying to take your energies and and that sort of a thing it's coming to an end it's coming to an end and this is what I've constantly telling people stop giving out your money to um, do negative energies to other people stop doing it because whenever people find out what you're doing they're gonna slam you down and this is exactly what um, happened this is exactly what is happening and this is what you are dealing with on Monday because someone is about to take you down and this is it that's why I stand back from so much people and I and move away from so much people because you can see negative energy even if people say that they don't do it they lie and I can see it on them and it's amazing to to realize how much people really dabble in negative energy really dabble to um, try and hurt other people there's a lot of people you will not understand there is a lot of people who dabble in this negative energies and go to these charmants and all these sort of a people to hurt other people and I've always said if you you know if you really think of you going you going to someone else to do something bad to someone else you know it is your it is your karma your karma is going to be coming out and it's not going to be good 
your karma is going to be coming out and it's not going to be good you were dealing with an Aquarius and this Aquarius took some of you to a shaman or this Aquarius is deep in shaman's shit and this is exactly that is happening because here you are seeing that she is looking out to see whether or not because she is working with other people you know whoever this first is she's working with other people whatever is happening she's working with other people so um you know and i always tell, tell people whenever someone go out of your life and come back in your life let them go let them go let them go there's a message of love that is going to be coming in for you and whatever is happening and whoever put you against your own family or against someone they're going to be meeting it and they're going to be meeting it very 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 badly you know they're going to be meeting it and they're going to be meeting it very badly and what you need to understand and to know is that love is the most powerful thing okay love is the most powerful thing um there's some help that is going to be coming in but the help is going to be um it's sort of a a block help help is going to be coming in but whatever that was blocking you this is coming to an end okay um, this is really really coming to an end whatever was blocking you this is really 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 coming to an end and then um, you are going to be seeing these things happen and that sort of a thing and you know there is a thing that I should always remind you guys about is that if someone you haven't spoke to in a while or someone hasn't connected with you in a while and then all of a sudden they call you and say hey how are you doing? how are you feeling I'm dandy I'm feeling fantastic even if you feel like shit because there's something they went to do and this is it because people are not, people were not people were just getting up and sick and not knowing why they were sick okay um people just healthy just become sick and people and it's like a miracle no it's not a fucking miracle it is that people go to shamans to kill other people okay and you people need to know you people need to know this okay and you people have been dabbling in this negative energy and this negative work and whenever you think that you can dabble into something and it never hurts you they same one or the same one who comes back and get you okay because you have to understand something with shamans and that sort of a thing once you go and you pay you will constantly pay for the rest of your life people okay you will constantly pay for the rest of your life and you need to understand this thing okay because they're always going to call you and tell you about some shit that is happening that is not even true they are going to do things uh, against other people that has nothing to do with you you know that sort of a thing because that's the way they keep you in bondage they constantly hold you on and keep you on bondage you need to know how to break the spell and release yourself why is it you need to go to a shaman because you think that someone is doing something most of these people can't read any shit most of these people do not understand they have you on the phone and you tell them all the thing and then they're going to say yes they're doing it to you lie <laughs> people stop going and giving out your money to these people to hurt other people it is sad it is sad and it's not good because it's something that is catching up on you guys now <sighs> now you guys um were with this woman whoever this lady was she was keeping you under control okay I this woman is looking to go a different part okay um, this woman connected with uh, um, this woman connected with this woman and um, this man okay and a, and a donka man and that sort of a shit and it is all a positive positive um, thing it is really 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 like a positive thing and they're so happy because you see this woman that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn needs this sort of attention in her life and it is basically that um, whoever this person is they're in that sort of a situation you know um, that sort of a um, situation that makes them feel good you know because they 
um, things is running for them and, and things is going for them and this is how they live their lives um, by the rules of the charmants and that sort of a thing how the hell you got into this situation God he knows uh, but you have gotten yourself in some serious shit and they're trying to take you down now so whatever the situation is know that there's a higher power and they can't take your life because they didn't bring you here so whatever they will, might want to work and whatever they might want to do it's not gonna happen and you need to call upon the mighty protection angel and call upon um, Archangel Gabriel and all the legions of angels to take the shit down show them who have the power now okay show them who have the power so we're going to look and see what else is coming out the end of the the tech is over okay the end of the tech is over and all these people yeah all these people because the only um, person that is um, and you know I don't even see things as friendship because people only friend you when they want something people only friend you when they want something I've been realizing this ever since I start um, and I know life people only friend you when they want something entanglement you have gotten yourself in some entanglement call upon the mighty powerful Archangels to use Archangel Michael to use the sword of truth to cut these um, negative situation that is going on stand up for yourself it's about time you stand up for yourself and stand up for yourself over this person who is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and this donka person they can't do you anything okay they can't do you anything because um, what you're seeing here is that um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libra she, she 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 needs to she needs to move forward she she needs to move forward okay um, she needs to move forward because whatever it is you're gonna be receiving a message of love whatever it is she needs to move forward she needs to um, it's time for her to make her um, the scent it's time for her to make her descent whatever that is transpiring and whatever that is um, happening it's time for her to make her descent okay house is in reverse the Sun comes out so whatever the situation is a new start um, with you ladies out there whatever the blocks was there's coming a new start whatever that this organization or houses it's breaking down and a new start is coming out for you ladies you okay and there is some luck that is coming in so um, what I'm seeing here is that really um, um, some people are going to be really really connecting with you um, there is really really going to be some um, lucky outcomes that is going to be happening um, here whatever the situation is uh, there is uh, going to be some lucky outcomes that is going to be happening here and you're going to be seeing this happening and I want to say to you if someone has left your life and all of a sudden they're coming back say no block these people you don't need to deal with these people um, block these people whatever the situation is you need to block these people you don't need to be with these people okay so um, I want to say to each and every person um, thank you for a returning cross watch you will have a lot of information that is coming up namaste